and welcome to day two of our virtual Norfolk Harbor Fest weekend. I'm Tim Wentz with Norfolk Fest Events, and although we cannot be in person this year, we are thrilled to be providing you another exclusive behind the scenes look at Harbor Fest weekend. We all know the food, tastes, and drinks of Harbor Fest are some of the festival's biggest draws, and this year we're proud to announce a new partnership with Cova Brewing Company out of Ocean View. The folks at Cova have crafted the Parade of Sales Pilsner in honor of Harbor Fest. Earlier this week, Cova hosted a Steal the Pint night to celebrate the release of the canned beer. Here's a look at a few of the highlights from that evening. Cova started uh, because two couples who live in this community really wanted to have a place where people could gather and build community. Um, there really wasn't a place like that down here in East Beach. We have lots of ways for people to engage with us here. We have a weekly events, we have uh, spaces where you can reserve private events. So there's always something going on here. Um, we really want this to be a community space. Our tap wall is ever changing. Um, if you come in a month, chances are there will be 14 new beers on tap. We also have monthly coffee releases with uh, new flavors, with coffee and with tea. So there's really always something brewing at Cova. We're back in the brew house at Cova Brewing and this is where 100% of our beer is brewed. Pretty much everything you have on draft here is brewed right back here. Our flagship offerings are something light, something dark, something hoppy, and something sour. Within those four genres, we will have something that fits in that brand for you. So one of my longtime friends, Angela Serretis, reached out to me and asked if Cove would be interested in doing a collaboration for Harborfest. And we thought, absolutely. Tons of people look forward to it every year, and we were honored to be asked to participate uh, with this well-known event. We really felt like our missions were similar, where we just bring people together, um, have fun, relax, and just enjoy life. So it just made sense. Harbor Fest is something that is nationwide attraction for this area. My grandmother made a point to come up here from Nashville two years ago, and, and she travels around to tall ship festivals all over the country when she can, and th this was a landmark for her. So we brewed Parade of Sales Pilsner, which is a nice light beer offering for summer. It's about five and a half percent alcohol, brewed with all U.S. grown ingredients, and we're excited to launch this beer this week with a special label with fest events and Harbor Fest. Being that we've only been around for less than a year, this is the first thing we've done with the the Hampton Roads community. Yeah, it's a good solid beer. It's a nice light beer without anything too crazy. You know, your average beer drinker will enjoy it without having to worry about it being hoppy or uh, you know too sour or anything like that. It's just a nice solid beer. Cove is absolutely fabulous. Honestly, it's become a community hub. Um, I live just a block away and my husband and I come here with the dog every morning for a cup of coffee. We come here almost every night for a beer or a glass of wine. Um, and just met so many great people here. The staff is absolutely fabulous. It's just a great spot. It's, you know, a local place. I feel like there's a lot of locals that come here and um, enjoy the beer. It's delicious beer. They have events, um, really brings the Ocean View community together. So I love it. The best way to keep up with us is on Instagram or Facebook. We also have a new website that we're launching soon and we are honored to bring a little piece of Harbor Fest to Cova. At Cova, we've got something for everyone, whether you like beer, wine, cider, coffee, lemonade, seltzer, there's, there's, if you like drinking anything, we have it for you. A very special thank you to Cova Brewing Company. And if you haven't had the chance yet, head out to Cova in Ocean View to get your very own six pack of the Parade of Sales Pilsner. That's right, it's super delicious. As we all know, in addition to the food and beverage at Harbor Fest, the entertainment, the live music is a major draw for the festival. And the festival has played host to many iconic musicians over the years, including Zac Brown Band, Cool and the Gang, The Wailers, and Grace Potter, just to name a few. This next segment, we're going to take a look back at Harbor Fest's recent history of performances and some of our favorite over the years. great when music is accessible for everyone so having festivals like this where they are free and just anyone can come in and they don't have to pay money is really awesome and we definitely love that vibe it's amazing look at
at all these happy people. It's awesome. It's yeah. awesome. Right Norfolk it's at its awesome. finest, absolutely. Especially with getting all the live music in, all the different events that they like to pull in. Uh, so far, it's been a blast, and it's definitely going to change the way this city is. Sister Sledge, uh, just take you back to the 70s a little bit. So y'all need to come on down here and get some of this too. Ladies and gentlemen, get on your feet, get on out the door, take you to the street. And as a fan of Harbor Fest, I love the boats uh, and I love the music. That's the, that's the two things I like best. Of course, I love the local performers at Harbor Fest. Um, the fuzz band, a lot of my different peers that play Harbor Fest too. It's cool to watch younger groups, uh, you know, build their brand, and I'd love to see them get out here and shine. I think we're gonna dance like fools and have a really good time. coming together and people really appreciating music. That video has us pumped to getting back to normal and watching concerts at Harbor Fest in Town Point Park with you all next year. And on Saturday evening of Norfolk Harbor Fest, the eyes shift from the main stage up to the sky high above the Elizabeth River for one of the region's most iconic fireworks shows. And although we couldn't provide the show this year, here's a unique look at some of our favorite fireworks clips. Fireworks display, yeah, absolutely fantastic. For those awesome fireworks. I'm excited for the fireworks. I know we'll be back for the fireworks. Of course, the fireworks, that is the big water event that everybody comes to see. The best fireworks show that you are going to see in this area, that's always been. And you can lay on the front of the boat and watch the fireworks and it's so peaceful and wonderful. The sun's going down. There's no other place to be, honestly. Kids just fell in love with the fireworks. There isn't any question about that.
what should you keep doing? Man, fireworks. There's no doubt about it. The fireworks is, in my opinion, is what draws the crowds. Man, we cannot wait to light up the sky once again on Saturday evening at Norfolk Harbor Fest. That's a wrap for day two of our virtual Norfolk Harbor Fest programming. Be sure to stay tuned to our social media channels all weekend long for additional content. Thanks and see you again soon. <laughs>